some emotions, typically I think basic ones, like fear, are ones that probably have one location. I think that the experience of fear is probably has to do with either the amygdala per se, or at least amygdala being a channel. So removing the amygdala for sure makes you not experience that. We have a unique patients, a few that I got to work with, who are people that are born with a unique disorder that, that makes it such that they don't have amygdala. And, and that would be quite dangerous, wouldn't it? Yes, I, I had experience of working with one patient. She is a, a woman who in fact does not have feeling of fear whatsoever. And this makes her life very difficult. She, she, she too trusting. So if she would meet you, she immediately hugs you and, and feels uh, too, idea. too comfortable with you. Idea. She doesn't have a sense of uh, distance the way we do. So if mm -hmm. I started speaking to you like this, let's demonstrate. Oh. Very close. <laughs> you, what, what happened just now is that, <laughs> <laughs> that you immediately had, that your amygdala immediately came to life and started firing <laughs> because, because there's some kind of distance that is too much. Yeah. All of those mechanisms are things that our bodies through evolution, were, uh, our brains basically, were uh, uh, creating in order to avoid danger and things that are uncomfortable. She doesn't have that. So it's very dangerous for her yeah, to yeah. just exist like that. The Feeling Brain, exploring the neural basis of emotion. Frontier science for the digital revolution.